All right, welcome back. Um, thank you for allowing me to take some time off. Just to be honest with you, there was uh, some burnout and uh, the grind of trying to get videos done constantly. Late fall, going into the winter, I just start focusing a lot more on mental health, family, but then also like music stuff. Uh, so I've been writing a lot and um, doing a lot of um, just music at my church, like singing and uh, playing on the weekends and everything. So uh, that's really been a big, uh, like, source of energy for me. I have been writing a lot of music um, and I'll be putting it out. Uh, in the next couple months or so, I uh, just kind of keep things a little bit separate. Like this is definitely still gonna be like the running vlog and race uh, film type channel. And then um, the other stuff will be more music based. Uh, and uh, specifically like writing songs for the church, like worship songs, like just really, really excited about what I've been doing. And I can't wait to share it with you guys um, on another channel. Also, I just picked up the Sony FX3, um, which I'm super, Super excited about shout out to Dave Dillon uh, for um, really honestly peer pressuring me into it no I'm just kidding uh, answering a lot of questions um, I've wanted the FX6 for a long long time but it's been unavailable worldwide for I don't know basically since it came out so FX3 was available <laughs> This thing like literally just came today. I've just barely had it on. In fact, the video that you're watching right now, everything that's not this shot right here was filmed on this camera. I've got some cool projects that I'll be working on with this camera. And one thing that I am going to be um, kind of like also testing out the waters this year is uh, working on some music videos. Uh, so I'm really pumped about that and I'll be sharing more uh, as that happens. <laughs> the main camera that's filmed almost everything on this YouTube channel has been the Sony a7 III, uh, which is really a photo camera that can do video. Uh, this, super excited to have this in my arsenal now, and a real legit video camera. Cinema line, you know, Netflix approved. But yeah, very excited to be working on everything pretty much from here on out on this channel for the foreseeable future on the FX3. I did apply for the Western States Lottery and the Hard Rock Lottery, and again, the High Lonesome 100 Lottery, and didn't get picked in any of them. So, uh, struck out 0 for 3 again. I mean, I did these three lotteries last year. I mean, this is actually the, I don't know if it's the fifth or sixth um, Western States and Hard Rock Lottery, but I mean, at this point, is anybody really gonna get into any of those races? Like, I do have a couple very exciting options for hundreds that I want to do. Um, I just have to get them kind of like cleared and worked out with family and everything. This year it's gonna be a hard rock qualifier. Which one is it gonna be? Uh, don't know yet. <laughs> And about Strava, there has been a lot going around about the price increase. I haven't specifically been hit by that increase yet. Uh, I am a premium subscriber, so we'll see if I continue to use it after, like if my price goes up to like $100 a year, I don't even really know what I use that is a premium feature. But the reason why I brought Strava up in the first place uh, was that just to remind everyone that I did make everything private on there. Um, every run that's uploaded is uploaded privately. So it's not that I'm not running, uh, I am still running. But bigger like races or like big weekend runs or something like trail runs or something that I'm excited, or running with friends or something like that, like I will make those public. And I will see if my thoughts on that change. Uh, it just feels better. It feels like a little bit more of a like healthy place to be for me right now to have all of that private. But all that said, I just want to thank you guys specifically for sticking with me, hanging around and watching this channel. I did get you pricey um, in the videos. I got a couple new tattoos. Um, I'm just really, really into tattoos right now. <laughs> Uh, I guess like I just love them uh, and you know for the longest time I thought I don't know you know like I might like regret a tattoo later um, and that's still definitely true uh, you know I always thought what if I get a job where I can't have tattoos or something and then I just like recently a couple months ago or something I was like what job am I possibly gonna get 
that I have to wear like short sleeves or something and tattoos are not acceptable. I was just like, I don't think I'm ever gonna have a job like that. <laughs> so I was like, let's do it. This is a lantern right here and here's a puzzle piece. Um, I've got an olive branch and a swallow and all of these have like really deep meaning to me uh, and you'll be seeing them a lot in videos. If you have questions about them or anything, I could explain them. 2023 is gonna be a good year. Lots of shoes to review, uh, lots of you know potential races to go look at uh, and hopefully sign up for. Um, maybe do some like meetups, you know, hopefully it would be really, really cool like if any of you are at some of these races I'm at. All that said, thank you for sticking with me. Thank you for watching this video, and I'll see you guys again soon. Bye.